Chanel from Pretty Hair is Fun and this week's hairstyle tutorial is going to be this really cute racer stripe ponytail. As you can see it's got two braids on either side. We love this hairstyle. It's great for school mornings because it's fast and best of all it works good on short hairstyles. So all of you that have been requesting short hairstyles, this one's for you. So have fun and we hope you like it. Let's get started. Okay, to begin this hairdo, you're going to want to part the hair off in three sections. So clip off this top section. Um, you want to make them pretty equal. And then I've parted this back to just behind her ear. You can see. So I've clipped that off. And then I'm going to begin my braid on the side. I'm going to spray this with just a little bit of water. And then I'm going to have her tilt her head to the side a little bit to make it a little flatter so I can braid easier. Are we doing a French braid or a Dutch braid? What's the... The what? flat or the one that sticks up? I like the flat one. The flat. Okay. So a regular French braid. Alright. So, to begin, you hold that for me please? You're going to want to part off a little section for your French braid. And you're going to want to make these braids small so you're not going to want to pull in big sections of hair when you do it. You want to keep it close to the head. You want to bring these braids back to where you clipped off your first section. And end it. You can either end it and ponytail it off or you can continue braiding it. So it goes into the ponytail and I'll show you what I mean. These small braids are not the easiest, even if you have small fingers. So don't feel bad if you have to do it a couple of times. This is our second tray. Okay, so I'm getting to where I'm almost even with this top section. So I will be pulling one more chunk of hair from back on the top. Kind of even that up. And one more, add hair from one more section down here. And then this is where you can either put an elastic in right here, or you can continue onto the braid. I'm gonna continue on, and I'm gonna pull this into her ponytail that will go in the back. You want to keep these sections especially tight and close to the head because when you pull the braid into her ponytail, if there's any looseness, it's going to gap. And then braid it back as far as you need it to reach the ponytail, maybe a little bit beyond. So for her length, that's going to be almost to the end. I'm going to put in a ponytail to hold it. Okay, that's our first racer stripe, and then we're going to do the same thing on the other side. Do you want me to comb? Yes, I do. And just do that the same way. Okay, now we've done both braids. So now we're ready to do the middle section. 
In this section, we're going to do some teasing, some ratting. Put your chin up for me, please. So I'm just going to take my teasing brush here. I'm just going to wrap this up. We want volume up here. And you can hairspray these after you tease them. But I don't think my girls like combing it out after. So I'm not going to do that today. We're just going to wrap a little bit. I think that more ratting is better for older girls and for moms. So we're just going to do a little bit less. My girls are a little bit younger. So moms tease away on your own hair and poof this part up. It'll look great. Okay, when you're all done ratting, I'm just gonna pull this section back. And I'm just gonna smooth it out on top. This is going to be pulled back in the ponytail as well. And this way you can kind of see how it's going to lay. Let's see, we need a little bit more volume on this side. I'm just going to kind of even that out a little bit. Like I said, I'm not going to make this poof up a whole lot on her, but just to make it stand up a little bit. Get that as smooth as you can. See the front. Okay. I'm gonna spray this a little bit. Now we're ready to pull everything back into a ponytail. So I'm gonna get my comb and my water. And I'm going to spray underneath a little bit. So I can smooth these sections in. Sorry if that's cold. I'm going to kind of move this to the side a little bit. Tilt your head down for me, sweetie. Thanks. I'm going to comb this up. Things smoothed in. Get that really smooth look on a ponytail. Always use the small end of your comb with the, with the fine teeth, and that will get the hair looking nice and even. Then determine where you want it to be. And we're going to bring in this top part. Can you put your chin up for me? This is the tricky part, is getting all the elements in at once. Bring in my braids. Okay, chin up, please. Thanks. And then you can use your little brush to smooth this in a little bit more. Your elastic ready. Okay. And then position it all. Okay, now you can take out these. 
they just blend in with the ponytail. Okay, let's check the front. Let me, okay. So, you can come through and tug on these little sections a little bit to make them a little more even. If you want a lot of volume as well with this part and you don't want to pull it down, you can ponytail this first and then pull it into the ponytail. So it's not going to get as flattened as what hers is showing if you want more of that volume. But that is the racer stripe ponytail with two French braids. You look like you're ready to go fast. <laughs> <laughs> we hope you like this hairstyle. Thanks for watching.